Blackhawk College is celebrating its first generation college students today. News 8's Jenna Webster shares the pressure this adds for two students and why they say they're not taking it for granted. New tonight at 6. For Blackhawk College freshman Maria Gerardo, stepping inside the college classroom is a first for her family. It scared me at first because I had like no one to guide me. As a first generation Incredible. student, she says there's okay. a lot of pressure, especially being the role model for her three younger sisters. Because then they have someone to look up to and they know what not to do or what to do. But it does feel like a lot of pressure sometimes because you're like, I don't want to mess up. A feeling echoed by second year student Natalia Rosales. The expectations mainly of like what everyone has for you now. And um, it's even hard for me since I'm the youngest of my family. So it's more like something that, of course, my older siblings couldn't have at all. On Monday, Blackhawk College celebrated first generation students like Gerardo and Rosales. Students were invited to come play games and to add their photo to the first in my family tree. And let students know that they're appreciated, that we're here for them. Lisa Hansen runs the college's TRIO program with the goal of helping provide first generation students with important resources. To just say, hey, what did you do when you were in this situation? So we want to make sure that they know that they can come to all of us, that we're their supports while they're here. Support that Gerardo says shouldn't be taken for granted. If someone is helping you, don't neglect that help because not everyone is as lucky or fortunate to have someone to guide them through the college process. And support both students say they look forward to giving to the younger generations in their families to attend college next. In Moline, Jenna Webster, WQAD News 8. There are nearly 1,500 first-generation college students at Blackhawk College for this semester.